guys, welcome to Thrifting with Sky. I am Adi Sky, and we are back for another episode. So, this is a spring break edition of Thrifting with Sky. Um, even though spring break was last month, and it was last month for a lot of schools, I decided to do it this month because the weather is more consistent and it's starting to feel more like spring. Last month was a little bit inconsistent, so a lot of the stuff that I bought. To prepare for spring <laughs> it was too cold to wear so come with me on this journey to a thrift store that I found in the area um, I went to prime thrift located in Waldorf and come with me on this journey let's see what I found y'all we are back at it again and it's springtime I absolutely love shopping for the spring because I'm so over wearing winter coats sweaters Boots, everything like literally bring on the jeans light jackets shorts short sleeve shirts like i can go on and on and the sandals of course wow this is about to be a good trip because i just stepped into the door and i see tons of stuff already i didn't even stop putting stuff in my shopping cart so i'll be back in a few moments to see what we find in the cart stay tuned So this is what I found today. Yep, some shorts, a hat, this purse. Yep, it's safe to say that I made out like a bandit. So you know what? You know the drill. I'm going to go through this cart. Yeah, that's going on with me. To see what's coming home with me today. While I do this, why don't you guys enjoy a quick beauty break? And we'll be right back. So, do you have the juice? And the answer is yes. In fact, I found the juice at Ulta Beauty. I've been dealing with frequent breakouts and I am in need of a good mask. And this bamboo pore refining mask from Juice Beauty definitely, definitely sealed the deal for me. It's made with charcoal to help detox the skin and aspen bark to keep the skin nice and hydrated. I apply this mask on twice a week after cleansing my skin using Juice Beauty Blemish Cleansing Wash and then follow up with serum and night cream. And of course, yes, I am that girl that put lip balm on before I go to bed. So, you got the juice now. That is Juice Beauty, of course. <laughs> okay, I need, I need to stop. <laughs> so, um... This is what I found. It's hard to see everything looking in the cart. So I just wanted to lay everything out on the bed so you guys can see. Um, yeah, this is everything that I found in um at the thrift store. And yep, I <laughs> these were some great finds. Um, don't worry, don't worry. I dry cleaned and also washed everything before putting it on the bed. But I actually wore some of these outfits already, and you know what? They were cute. They were real cute. So first I found this really cute basic um, top. Um, <laughs> there's not much to say about it. It's just a white top and it has details in the back of the blouse. Um, not really a midriff top, but it's cute. Definitely could wear it with jeans, skirt, whatever. All purpose, definitely come in handy. Next I found this top i love this top um i actually wore it when it was a little cooler last month and i like the fact that the shoulders are out but i think what would make this um top a little bit better is that it had like a little turtleneck along, along with the v-neck um shape so um um if it was a little tighter too as well but definitely will look cute with my leather skirt that i have like a knee length leather skirt skirt and some regular black jeans. Yeah, I like this. So, as you guys know, I love silk. And you guys probably remember this blouse from the Clueless video when I recreated the share look when she was shopping. <laughs> I also wore this with these cute blue, high-waisted blue um, pants that I got from Zara. Um, check out. 
Yeah, it's cute, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, so next is this really cute dress that I found um, at the thrift store. It was different. I usually don't go for, I never go for a color like this. I'm more like bright yellow, pink, blue, like really bold colors, but this definitely stood out. Um, I wore this with like um, some really cute earrings um, that had like a little pink in it. Um, my shoes was definitely um, some wedges that had different colors, like that gray, like a different color pink. I don't, don't ask me what kind of color pink. You'll see it in the um, video um, on how these looks look. But honestly, I don't have the patience to put this on and put this back because the details in the back alone has to be, has to be perfecto. Next, of course, um, when I went to the thrift store, I couldn't stay away for the details. I, okay, I don't know if you guys know this, but I love showing my back. Any type of details in my back, I'm picking it up, no matter how difficult it is. And <laughs> example, I just complained about the, uh, about the, the previous dress. But this one right here that I got is really cute. Like I wore it a couple times. Definitely, um, definitely can be wore like with a bandeau, right? Or just a black bra. Or if you're going to work, you could wear it like a white, I mean, a black tank top under it. But see the front and look at the back. Look, it just snaps. So it's really cute. It was cute. This was a cute with a nice cute skirt or okay or like a nice cute like pencil skirt right or it can look cute with these bouquet cut pants that i found at the thrift store too as well um like i said before it's very rare to find it's very rare to find like a full outfit so when you do you get a little excited so these are like a magenta color bouquet pants if they're not in magenta please don't please don't come for me because i don't know all the colors <laughs> there's a lot of colors but it's pink it's like is it hot pink or magenta no it's hot pink it's definitely hot pink but these pink um boot cut pants paired up with this blouse definitely got the work done so next is this really cute v-neck with a collar short sleeve blouse really cute all i could definitely do a lot with this shorts jeans skirt i never had a color like this before and the color actually looked nice with me but y'all want to know what i did with it so i actually paired it with this cute distressed jeans they're high-waisted too and they're not tight as well and this and this look look really cute together and also i wore like a nice little multicolored belt and some harachis it was a different look that i was definitely going for like really perfect for a nice chill day or then you want to wear flats you don't have heels all the time but nice chill casual day shopping just being out and about and these jeans are cute too as well like high-waisted a nice little outfit too so I got two outfits there. Let's see what else. Um, next is this wraparound blouse. This is really cute. Um, I wore this to my niece's birthday party, and it was show show a little tiny bit of stomach, but just easy wrap around, and it's really nice on a hot day. And y'all don't don't get me started. I got another outfit here. <laughs> I wore it with these cute khaki linen pants, okay? These cute khaki linen pants. These are really nice. This and this together with some nice sandals. Really cute, especially on a 85-ish, mm, 85 weather day. Um, definitely keep you warm and very light too as well. So, y'all, that is three outfits, right? Three outfits like really three outfits like how did i become this lucky 
I call it a blessing, right? <laughs> so now for, I always have a grand finale when I go in these thrift halls because I, I get excited when I find like a really something very unique. So that for me is this trench coat, right? Now I know it's a little too hot to wear this now, but this definitely came in handy when during the transition from winter to spring. So like I say, back in April, I mean, spring officially started what march 21st spring didn't really officially start into may over here but this is like i said consistent weather but this is really good for the transition and i love the color it's a really nice lavender color i never found a color like this before it's definitely i'm speechless okay i'm just speechless I love the color. I never had, I never found like a lavender color. Guys, now it's time for the accessories. I Okay, if y'all don't know, if y'all didn't know by now, I love purses. Purses is one of a must-have accessories um, for me. Um, I think they're like a step over shoes. Don't don't judge me, but if y'all know. So I found these really cute bags that are very unique. Like this one first. This is cute. I actually wore it with the... Um, what the jury's out on what color pink that is magenta no you know what it's hot pink it really is I wore this bag with um, the hot pink and the white blouse when I was out and it was cute you know it had a it has a lot of cute colors so this bag will look good with any bring out any type of outfits but I mean, the material is not what it needs to be but it looks unique I mean I probably could get another year out of it right Next is just another simple purse. Yep, just a purse. Um, I left a tag in it. Um, this is seven dollars. It's cute. I like it. So next, <laughs> see, look at me keeping name tags on everything. I get so excited, and I forgot to take the name tags off of everything. This hat, super cute, three dollars. I love a good straw hat, especially when I'm going to the beach. I never had something quite this style before, but I definitely know what I'm going to do with this. Um, definitely given summer. Y'all, I think this is giving Hillary from Fresh Prince. <laughs> it's definitely giving Hillary from Fresh Prince, but I definitely have an idea what I'm going to do with this hat for the summertime. I'm definitely going to get a lot of nice wears out of this. <laughs> All right, guys. So that is it from my spring shopping. I hope you enjoyed each of the looks. Um, I have a little cute little video for you to see how um, the looks actually looked on me. Make sure you subscribe and also like the video. And also put in the comments on which look you like the best. Which piece you like the best as well. Um, that is all I have for you today. So thank you for hanging out with me. And remember, when it comes with fashion, do you. Because what's for you is for you. Thank you. Have a great day.